Turo Accelerate to Step Flow Calibration Process. The first step in flow calibration process is the 15 second catch test, which calibrates actual flow to system pressure. Important, if the 15 second catch test is not done correctly, the three minute flow calibration will also be incorrect. Measurements by the system will then be inaccurate, which will result in over or under application of products. Access the main menu with the far right button. Press and hold. Buttons under arrows to scroll down to calibrate. Select flow. Fill tank half full with water. Start and run engine. Important, machine should be at operating temperature before proceeding with calibration. Set part break and proceed to next screen. Select installed nozzles and proceed. Set dashboard switch to manual mode and ensure boom bypass valve is off. Make sure all booms are lowered and switched on. Turn on sprayer pump, turn off agitation, and set engine to full throttle. Proceed with test using right arrow button. Make sure it's in manual spray mode and adjust the pressure to approximately 40 psi. Pump will be running and all booms will be on. Now perform the 15 second catch test. Compare your catch test results with what your target is. If they do not match, you will need to adjust pressure and rerun the 15 second catch test until they match. Readjust your pressure and do another 15 second catch test if they do not match. Again, compare your catch test results with what your target is. When the target and results match, depress the right arrow button to move to the second step of the calibration process. The next step in the flow calibration process will be a three minute volume over time calibration to ensure accuracy of the system. The step is done after the 15 second catch test, which calibrates pressure to volume. Press the right arrow button to proceed. Press the right arrow button to continue with calibration process. Machine will now be spraying in a stationary mode. Once flow calibration process has started, the machine will continue to spray for approximately three minutes. It will then stop by itself. Do not shut off or alter any adjustments during this time. Flow meter is now measuring the volume of water passing through it and comparing it to expected known volume. After approximately three minutes, the flow calibration process will automatically shut off. The controller compares the target volume to the actual volume measured and adjusts the calibration factors to ensure accuracy. Calibration is successful. To press the far right button to exit and save calibration. Calibration process now complete.